Hey, in this short video, I'll show you how to create a voucher that can be redeemed when purchasing your products. Before this though, you must have already created a product, which we now need to convert into a voucher. You'll learn how exactly to create a product in the video that's now linked in the top right hand corner. You can also set up the order form for it if you want. You can learn how to do this again in the video that's now linked in the top right hand corner. But now let's get into it. As mentioned, we first need to convert our product into a voucher. To do this, first go to account, and then products, then click on the pencil icon next to the relevant product, and as soon as the page is loaded, select voucher in the product type field. Now scroll to the bottom and click on save. As you can see here, there's now a new tab at the top entitled voucher. Here we can specify all the properties of the voucher. It goes without saying that the most important setting is the voucher amount. You can set a single amount or let the customer choose between several specific amounts. In this case, you have to separate the amounts with a comma and space, as I'm doing right now. But you can equally let your customers choose freely, which means they'll be able to enter an amount themselves. To allow this, simply select yes here. Now specify the currencies in which the voucher is offered and then enter the text that should be displayed here instead. Don't forget to add list or select to your text so that your customers can select the correct amount. The placeholder list means a selection list will be displayed. The placeholder select means a dropdown will be displayed. Once you're happy, click on save. Your voucher is now created. The question now remains, how can your customers redeem it? Well, it's very simple. On your order form, there's the voucher field. If it's a responsive order form, it'll be displayed here. If it's a classic order form, it'll be displayed here. And if it's a multi-step order box, here is where it will be displayed. Your customers simply enter the voucher code which is displayed and sent to them after they've made their purchase. The amount is automatically deducted from the price. Here's the slightly tricky thing though. By default, this field is not displayed, which is why you have to activate it first. Let's do that now. This is because we need to create a discount code. The difference between a voucher and a discount code is that a discount code is a specific code that deducts a certain amount or percentage from the purchase price. You can then send this code to customers, use it for a sales offer, and so on. If you want to know more about this, you can watch the video that's now linked in the top right hand corner. However, the voucher code field on the order form will only be activated and visible if there's also a discount code for this product. You should therefore do the following. Go to Settings, and then Discount Codes, and click on Create Discount Code. Enter a code that would be unguessable, for example by randomly typing on your keyboard. Finally, in the For Products field, select all the products for which you want to activate the voucher code field. Once you're done, click on Save at the bottom, and you'll have now activated the voucher code feature. Congratulations! 